Amid growing Chinese pressure, Taiwan will start mass production of the Xiongshen service-to-service -service missile this year. The missile is an extended-range variant of the Xiongfeng 2E missile. With an estimated range of 1,000 to 1,200 kilometers, it can travel far enough to reach China's Central Theater Command. Experts say it can be fitted with high explosive or cluster munition warheads, which can be used against enemy command posts, bunkers and airport runways. With a thunderous roar, a missile launches into the sky. The National Zhongshan Institute of Science and Technology conducted live-fire missile tests on Wednesday at Pingdong's Jiopeng military base and Chenggong Township in Taidong. Amid this latest round of missile tests, new details have emerged about Taiwan's Xiongsheng missile program. According to Defense Ministry reports submitted to the legislature, a facility will be ready to mass-produce the missile starting this June. The Xiongsheng program is a plan to upgrade the Xiongfeng 2E, drawn from Taiwan. The combat radius of this new missile can cover China's Central Theater Command. This means that the Central Theater Command, which is located behind the Taiwan-facing Eastern Theater Command, that entire region and all its military targets, and particularly its airports, will all be within the range of our Xiongsheng missiles. The Xiongsheng missile has an estimated range of 1,000 to 1,200 kilometers. At least 100 missiles will be mass produced. In terms of this missile's application, conventional high explosive warheads can be equipped with armor piercing capabilities so that they can penetrate and detonate on reinforced military targets, such as bunkers. The second type of warhead releases cluster bombs in line with international conventions, that is, conventions on cluster munitions in relation to self-destruct devices. So the Xiongshen missile is very important to the asymmetric defense of the Republic of China. This is classified national security information. I can only say that it has a tremendous range. Once a missile enters mass production, whether we're talking the Xiongfeng 2, the Xiongfeng 3, or the extended Xiongfeng 2 and Xiongfeng 3 cruise missiles, the the total number of missiles cannot be publicly disclosed, but it can be said that the numbers will increase by leaps and bounds. Besides building an arsenal of the Xiongsheng missile, Taiwan will step up the production of other missile types to boost its ability to delay or paralyze an enemy invasion.